CG Shadow Ops L96. So this is the uh, this able version of it. So what you got here is got the body of it. ABS plastic. Here you have the bipod. Two magazines. Slime. Barrel. Scope. Butt stock. Chin rest. And so I will be pulling this together. So first be putting the pipe, which just goes right in there, just like that. Second, I will be pulling the barrel. Which goes in just like that. Now I need an Allen wrench. I'm going to flip to the bottom. There's a screw right here. She need to tighten it up. There's another one right here by the trigger. Alright. Next, I'm going to be putting the scope on. goes on. Just like that. Alright. Now for the buttstock. Take this. First put this on. Gotta push it. Straight on, just like that. Next, you take the screws and this Allen wrench. And then you put the screws. Just plug that. Next, cheek rest. So it comes with two screws right here. Put it straight on like that. There's two holes on this side. Simply just, once again, same Allen wrench. Just screw it in just like that. Now, put this sling on. There's two clips on both ends. Clip one right there. Clip another one right there. And that is pretty much the look of the gun. And it comes with this Allen wrench, which is for your hop up, which is right here. This is a magazine release, right here. Hop up is just right in there. You can screw it left and right for hop up. And so, today, we will be using 20 grips. And, next video, I'll be showing you 43 grips. Now, one thing I do got me about this gun, I wish it would have made the magazine better. If you can see, it's got to put it by one. 
it's like that, which is always a pain because when you're out in the field and run out of both magazines, it takes you forever to reload. Alright. Holds about 25. I noticed that you can get about 23. 24th one's kind of hard to get in. Because I noticed which one or so. Put it into the gun. Just like that. Now I have a can out in the woods that I will be shooting at. See it right there. Now the 20 grams shoot about 450 FPS. Actually, this is the best. Like I said, in the next video I'll be showing you 43 grams, which will increase the accuracy and the distance. But initial speed 20 grams are always going to be faster. So here we go. And of course, as you can see, Ken's still up there. So now, next video, I'll be showing you 43 grams.